You're on to the program that takes you through the world of creativity in just 30 minutes. A warm welcome to Art House. On today's edition, we show you what contemporary artists are doing in their little corners. We'll get more details after our Artie Quote segment. Join us again. The African woman is intelligent, beautiful, hardworking, and everything an ideal woman should be. She has great independence of spirit. Unity in Diversity is an exhibition of paintings done by contemporary artist Abidemi Demore. Let's see what he had to show. Didi Museum in Lagos, Southwest Nigeria. That's where Abidemi Demuren has decided to hold his solo exhibition and an audience has gathered to give this young hand the much needed support. Bidemi is a multi-talented artist, but for this show, he stuck to one of his skills, visual arts, a passion which grew from his love for comics and illustrations to a medium of finding his own voice. While growing up and trying to cope with some form of dyslexia, it never seemed to have any impact when he had his art materials with him. It was just the freedom he needed to express himself. All the voices in his head that could not find expression in words took solace on the canvas. Sometimes when I go to like weddings and I see those Americans and I see those drummers coming out with their drums and their playing, that is that is what uh, that is what gives me my inspiration. been pencil, pen, ink and paper, a love affair that has blossomed into the works displayed here today. Some of them capture celebrations. Others show people working or just taking a nap after a hard day's work. It gives me a like the is because uh, sometimes when I go around outside, I see I see those um, I see those um, Aosa people taking a break and I see them sleeping in the way barrel. So one day I just told myself, ah, let me just do something like that because it will make people understand the, the work better. One can notice something about the images. They are faceless or trying to hide behind a mask. No details of the subject are revealed from the face. Just the action and all the colors are vibrant, no matter the task they are engaged in. I use, I use so many colors to do my work. I can use blue, I can use green, I can use any color. Depends on what I call it, depends on the color that fits the, that fits the artwork, and that's what I use. Probably a believer in the dignity of labor or following the Shakespearean notion that you can't tell the art's construction on the face. For a young hand, Abidemi appears like a deep thinker. His style may look simple, but the way he looks at the subject reflects a man far beyond his years. 
Trying to find the truth or just hiding from it seems like the question on his mind. I'm really thrilled to see all the work has been doing. And, um, and, and you know, when you move away from the wall and you're in the center and you look back, it's just gorgeous. It's just tremendous amount of work there. And, uh, you know, artists, they have their quality, they have their insight, they have their understanding of her. And that's what has been displayed. I really enjoyed it. Very, very good in it. Very thrilling. I think a lot of uh, talents displayed. And you see what the what is in the heart being put on picture for all to see. I'm impressed. This is his first outing. And uh, I didn't know it would come out this well. Because I kept saying, let's wait till next year. And he said, no, mommy, we just have to do it. We need to do it now. And we can learn whatever lessons we take. We we'll use it to improve the next exhibition. So he always wanted to hold an exhibition in order to showcase his own style of art, which is different. And uh, I'm happy today that this has been a reality for him and he's very excited about it. This artist honed his skills at the Dutchess Community College in New York and later studied animation and graphic design at the Art Institute of Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania in the United States. That may explain why his works look like a combination of graphic designs and drawing. When I first came back to Nigeria, I went around the whole of Lagos and I, and I noticed that most people were doing their work differently. So and I told myself that I want to do my work so that my work can stand out. That is why you can see my work is like this. Because if you, um, if you go anywhere in Lagos right now, you will not see any artist doing, doing this kind of style. I'm the only person that does this kind of style. So that when people see there's something, they will, under, they will know that I'm working it. If someone sees it from far, they will know that it is me. I'm the person doing the artwork. The way you see creativity, originality coming up, it's very, it's very, it's very unique indeed. Uh, it's a thing that uh, will grow stronger and you can see better results in, in life. This is good. This is good for them. It's good for our country. It's good for our people. And, and we can show our culture. You see, it's, uh, it speaks volumes. Just one single drawing, you can, it's, 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 very, it's very astonishing. But even with his studies abroad, this artist has sure not forgotten his roots, as all his works capture the beauty of tradition and culture. East or West, home is the best, and Abidemi Demuren has reflected this in his art. He is anxious to up his game the next time he comes calling.